Welcome to FIFA Ultimate Team. Yes, guys, that's right. Welcome to Ultimate Team, or should I say, welcome to Skill into Glory Season 2, because it is also back again for FIFA 17. If you've never heard of the series before, then I would recommend watching uh, closely to this video and also pay attention to everything what I say, because it is maybe somewhat difficult to kind of understand how this all works. But it's a series I've been doing since, uh, I think, at the start of FIFA 14. So, um, yeah, I think most of you guys are very happy that it's back. I'm very happy that it is back. And uh, one thing that you should know as well, that the daily uploads are pretty much back again. Because uh, this is a series I will be doing daily. So, uh, hopefully, you guys are really, really uh, enjoying this series for FIFA 17 as well. Hopefully, we can complete it uh, compared to, uh, to last year. But uh, what is Skill into Glory? It is basically a series where we test out every single five-star skiller and build a squad around them and also complete challenges. That is the main part of this series. So uh, the first thing you will see in this video is, of course, a bit of a different menu compared to what you usually would see. Everything you will see in this video is all edited by me and just everything you will see in the entire series. It took quite some time to put everything together. So if you could drop your support in the comments down below and make sure to leave a like, it would be uh, more than appreciated. So um, yeah, just let's get right into this, I would say. We're going into the skillers up. You can see right there we have four sections of players. Those are obviously the, the kind of ratings we have in FIFA, we have Bronze, Silver, Gold, and then also on Xbox we have Legends. So the first type of skiller we actually have this year is a Bronze 5 star skiller. We have two of them, you can see it at the bottom, 0 out of 2 completed. When it comes to the Silver skillers, we have actually 10 Silver 5 star skillers this year. Um, I already included the newest uh, Silver 5 star skiller, Chanturia, and the same goes for the Gold ones, where we actually have 27 this year. And then when it comes to the Legends, uh, we have two, we have Okocha and Pele. So um, we obviously start from the bottom. We start with the lowest rated player, and that is this year, actually, Edison Flores from Peru, who plays in the Danish League. He's the first player we're going to be testing out and try to complete all the challenges with, and uh, we actually have 10 games in order to do that. If we unfortunately don't complete all the challenges in time, we have to start over again, and um, yeah, as soon as we don't complete them, we won't be able to move on to the next 5-star skiller. Uh, for this sake, it is going to be Odua, since he's then the, the next one in, in line, basically. Um, as soon as we complete Edison Flores as well we do get a reward in the new skiller Odua and we also get two premium gold packs I'll get a little bit later into those and uh, we also are able to use any version of that player we unlocked this time Flores for example he has an inform from that point onwards we are able to use that version as well and if you want to know if he has an inform you can see that the bottom right Flores has so if you complete the challenges with him we can use the inform which is pretty cool uh, then moving on to the challenges for this year we only have three challenges because I don't want to make the series too long and especially for each player that it takes too long in order to complete those challenges so um, I think three, uh, three challenges with ten games is I think a good amount if you want anything changed then yeah let me know in the comments down below as well but um, you can see pretty much how it all goes we have a certain challenge you can see sort of a bio of it on the on the right hand side and um, yeah that's uh, pretty much the way it goes for this year so um, yeah let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section down below as I said before if you want anything changed then make sure to let me know because tomorrow I uh, would like to upload episode 2 already and um, I also need another thing from you guys, and that is actually a team around Edison Flores. I still don't have a team. You guys are kind of the ones who are able to make the teams for me when it comes to the skillers. So um, if you like to do that, then uh, be sure to uh, drop me a link either on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, or maybe in the comments. And um, maybe I'll use your team if that's the case. Then I will always leave a link to uh, to the squad you made on either Fortnite or Fortwist in the in the description down below. So um, that's where we're pretty much going to be ending off this video, guys. Again, really hope you enjoyed the series. If you did, then make sure to leave a like; would be very much appreciated. So I'd like to thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye bye.